Hello, this is Carl Henricks, the laundry expert, and I'm with HK Laundry Equipment, and we're going to go into another series with the CCI flagship card systems. In this scenario, a customer has called up and said that they've lost their laundry card. So there was value on it, they want to make it invalid, and they want to have that money transferred to their other card. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over to the manager. We've logged in traditionally. We're going to go to cards and what we're going to do is we're first going to search for the card now the person's name is uh, Hermenez and what's going to happen is Maria has actually lost the card and we uh, she wants to transfer it over to her mother's card so here's Maria okay and her mother is Thelma so first we're going to go into Maria's card. We're going to double click here. So there it is. She's lost this card. So the first thing we're going to do, we see we've got 35 cents that's out there. And we're going to make it invalid so no one else uses it. We're going to put a comment in here. We're going to say transferred over to Thelma's card. And we're going to put a Thelma's card number that was 5712. Okay, put an apostrophe in there. We're going to save it. So the card is now invalid. If Maria finds it and tries to use it, it's not going to work. We show that we've got 35 cents there. It's not going anywhere. And all we're going to do is we're going to transfer it over to Thelma's card. So the next thing we need to do, data's been saved, so we need to go back and we need to go to Thelma's card. Okay. Thelma's card is right here. If you take a look, Maria's card now is not available on this because we're only showing customers' cards and not invalid cards. So let's go over to Thelma. We'll double click on her. And we're going to transfer the money over. So she had 35 cents plus $1.35 is going to be $1.70. We put the new mount in there. We're going to save it. And then we're going to put some notes in because I always forget. 35 cents transferred from uh, 9645 laundry card. Okay, spelled it right. Cool. Okay, and we're going to go Thelma. We have added. 35 cents from Maria's laundry card. Thank you. Okay, what's going to happen is on the special message, the next time Thelma puts her laundry card in the exchanger, this little message will pop up. As soon as it pops up, it'll show it to her once and then disappear. So we're going to save this again. Okay, data saved. We're going to come back, and that's all there is to it. It's a slick little system. Uh, if we actually want to see both valid and invalid cards, we can search them now for Jimenez. And there's Maria, but it's got a different color to it, and there's a line through it showing that it's inactive. It's invalid. And then Thelma's here now shows the new balance of $1.70. Okay, so that's how you go and find cards, you identify it. Now we can search by name, we can search by Maria, okay, and we can find lots of cards there. But there's Maria's card that comes up. We can also search under Thelma and take a look, and there's Thelma's card that's come up. So it gives us a tremendous amount of power. Okay, hopefully you've enjoyed this and uh, stay tuned and search our website for more interesting topics on this. This is Carl Henricks, HK Laundry Equipment, thanking you for joining us.